All right, all right, all right. I'm here with my van top. Just came in H H six one two or H six twelve T. The van top mirror, dash cam mirror. And the reason I'm doing this video is because that you can see it right there. Huge mirror. Let me show you. Boom. I needed a better camera. I needed a better camera that can record. And I did a lot of research, and Vantop is actually one of the best products for the price point that they're asking. And I'm going to tell you why I chose it. I have an old camera here, a little Whistler. And it did good. I, I would never complain about that product. Um, it has a camera on both sides. You can adjust the camera, move it in and out. You know, you can turn it around so it's facing the inside of the vehicle. One's facing in, one facing out. But when the sun comes in on this camera here, it whites out the screen right with the van top when the sun comes in the, sc the screen still looks like this the sun does not mess with it they have done a great job with this this uh dash cam mirror a really a really great job now if you look here time and date they also have a gps on this side with my fingers pointing but i didn't install that I, I, I see no need to put the gps in there um it has a rear camera so when you swipe to the right to the left that's my rear camera. That is actually inside the vehicle pointing out, right? You swipe it again, split screen. So rear camera on one side, split screen on the other. Now this is a big, uh, big dash dash cam mirror. But this is why I wanted to do the video because I've seen a lot of videos on this. But my mirror is actually huge. It has a huge round backing on my mirror, and I didn't think it would fit. And that's been one of my problems with doing these mirrors. Is they don't have enough cable it's not it, it, the attach, attachments aren't enough to fit around my mirror that uh, van top has made it made it to where I can install their camera on top of my huge mirror you see it poking out right here on the side that mirror is huge and it's still able to get up there and be comfortable I don't have OCD where it bothers me but it's an easy install easy rip very clear Swipe, swipe back to the front. If you swipe back to the front and you hold this the left side, look what I can do with the camera. <laughs> it's amazing. It, go to the right side, controls the biteness. Just finger touch. That is amazing. Swipe. I want to go in full reverse. If I want to drive with both of them on, easy touch. And it's voice control. So, with that being said, it's voice control. You can talk to it, say front camera, say back camera, it'll, it'll go to it. This is the best camera to have for the price point, and uh, that's why I chose that. Versus, I'm going to get rid of this one here. I don't need it no more. I got this one, and I want to weigh the decisions on it. So if you have a dash cam like this, my recommendation is to go ahead and jump up to the Van Top H612T. Trust me, 4K, 1080p, easy to install, easy to adjust. Love this camera.